everyone so I've been talking a lot and spinning a lot about Serena being 8-8 bulwark and still way too squishy so I wanted a stone skin talent and well they were selling one for a hundred dollars the other day so I bought it we uh, right there so I'm gonna go do a couple things here and then um, put the stone skin on and do the same things over and see just what we notice. So really it's just going to be Lost Realm and uh, some raiding bases. You know, to see how much longer she lasts, like just her and Dove Keeper. So to do this, I'll be fair. Let's see where she is. Okay, she's not on a pet. So no RNG there. No help there, just her and instant proc is okay with me. And then we'll take Dove Keeper to have fun. Um, we don't want, we don't want that. Just because survivability is the name of the game. That's what we're testing out, right? So we don't want them have pets that can heal and whatnot. Um, is she in an artifact? I don't think so. Oh, there she is. There, so she's got no artifact help. Crest is just revite, so it's really no help. No pet help. Um, and Dove Keeper. I'm trying to think. Just to make sure I'm not wrong. Dove Keeper doesn't actually help her at all. But just for fun, let's go ahead and... No, we can't do that, can we? Who had... Oh, there it is. We'll do that. See how much we can get Dove Keeper nuking for while we're doing this, because she's so fun that way. Um, where am I going? Back to the artifacts. Dove Keeper, I don't want you here. I want you tearing things up. Here. Yes. Yes. All right. Wow. How did I manage to get 516 gold? It's weird. It's weird. Do we have minnow just to clear out? Okay. All right. I think that's all we need to do. I hate realizing after I made the video that I <laughs> totally missed something. So I think that's all we need to do. Got my pen in case there's anything I want to write down. All right. Let's take her out. See how she does. And just given the nature of not being able to repeat the same bases or whatnot, I mean, it is what it is. So we're not going to have like this nice data that we could go off of. Um, we'll drop her again because we want to see her survivability. Ooh. Oh. See what I mean about Squishy? Not this stone skin's going to be all the difference. Well, this one could be just fun. Let's go uh, wait. Mm. Maybe we will drop Dove first because that's a more natural scenario. Oh, look at her, man. She almost got one-shotted right there. I wish I was watching her enough to see. Oh, boy. Two-shotted. Come on, Dove. Make them pay. Freaking two-shotted. Not cool. Gosh. And that's, again, why I want... Um, stone skin just reducing that damage you don't get just wasted like that and that's what's happening to me when I try to um, use her in Guild Wars but I want to use her because that buff and if it lands on the right hero mostly Dove Keeper then good good night you know so I need her to live to make that land and Bulwark I just don't feel like it's doing the trick and really her damage is not all that consequential because you're less concerned about how much damage she's doing and more how much buffing she's doing to help the uh, real damage. What's going to happen here? Don't get shot. Nuke him, Dove. Oh, Dove, yeah. 
Oh shit, I don't know who it was. I just looked up and saw their health just go to zero. This is nice. Look at Dove Keeper, man. These are double evolved heroes. Max 200. And these two right here are just wrecking them. Come on, Dove. Wreck him, wreck him, wreck him. Don't let a noob get in there at the same time. This could be bad. Get that heal off. Come on, Skeletal, because I'm almost at it. I want to let it ride. Oh, come on, Dove. Ah, uh, get out of there. Damn, that was close. But not, not too shabby, right? That's That shows you how these two together just work so well. Doesn't I see this a lot. I see Anubis getting attacked. Does Anubis have low health? Is that why he reses three times? Never really thought of him as being a low health hero, but... 276 plus 140 is almost like, what, 400... 10, 420,000 or something. Um, and he he was being targeted over Skeletica. So... He has less health. Doesn't she target the lowest health enemy with the lowest HP? Oh, okay. Wait. Is it the lowest HP at the time that she procs? So meaning how much health they have of their bar? Or is it the lowest maximum health? That could be... It's probably lowest of what they're at, because that would explain why you see some heroes getting hit, like the Anubis, when you would think that they should be procking on the uh, lower health, maxed health heroes. Oh, that should be fun. What do we got, guys? Yeah, Dove Keeper. Boom, taking them out. Come on, heal, heal, heal. Better heal, girl. Ooh. Dev actually took a pretty good pounding there. Hmm. What is that? A Ronin? Solo a Ronin? Solo a Anubis? Let's see if we can solo this Anubis. Come on, Dev. Just kill this stuff. It'd be sweet. Ooh, whatever it was, I didn't see the figure, but she hit him hard. Nubis getting wrecked. Mago or M at go. Let this be a uh, training video for you, bro. Your base isn't very good. As far as look, I can just sit out here and pick off your Michael with this snipe. If I wanted to get dirty, or your Anubis, if I wanted to get dirty, I could throw another hero down, but I'm just seeing what these two do. They killed everyone else. You uh, don't sex to hit Dove because she's got limited damage. Hmm. What's happening here, guys? The stunning's still getting us, so we need to have a Doom Balloon. <laughs> Take out this tower. Two minutes. Oh, oh, whoa. He was like half health, and then I saw his health go to full. That's when I was like, oh, and then he's dead. So he must have got one shot at hardcore. Oh, when did I put down my Walla? <laughs> oh, boy. It's been a long day. Well, we're testing survivability, and there it was. Ooh. Minnow and his low health. Sounds kind of loud. Sorry if it was. All right. A couple more of these. Just so we can see. I mean, we definitely saw how she gets one-shotted. But in the last one, when there was very moderate damage from one hero, you also saw how she can live. Oh, I think we're going to see how she dies on this one. I'm about to lose Dove there. Another thing to consider in a real testing environment is that we wouldn't be using her or these two heroes in this scenario, um, or in a real life scenario, I guess you could say, because, ooh, go, go, smoke that Athene. Oh, it's all these stuns. Um, because you would have a pet, you would have artifacts, you would have that other help. So see, she's getting hit pretty hard there. Definitely the uh, 
Hmm, let's see what happens. The uh, stun towers. Wow, she just got wasted right there. The stun towers uh, make it really tough. Wow, she got wasted. That's what I don't want to happen. That's why I'm going stone skin. Guild Wars, we went against a guy who I think had like 420 or 440,000 might. And so he is pretty tough and we just every time Serena's boom dead. See it like this. Alright, so I think you guys get the idea. At least in the raids, how easy it is for her to die. Again, we don't I know we don't have pets, blah blah blah. That's not the point. Okay. And then here, this is a normal fight. This is my team, my number one fighting team. I switch it up based on if I lose and I'll I'll switch something like Michael in and blah blah blah. But watch these fights. I've purposely kept a bad team in um, so I can for a few days so I can make this video with this many altars open. And I'm gonna try to end it before it's over. But we'll see how often Serena just dies fast. They're on her now. She's all but dead. Dead, right? Anyone agree? Yeah, she's dead. So we're getting owned right here. She died quickly. Died quickly. And I think they're on her again. As far as they dove. Some, yeah. Serena or Walla? Well, Walla's dead. I don't see Serena, so maybe they went to Walla once Serena died. Okay. Next, next battle. So let's see. Make myself a note to go one, two, three, four, five. So we do the same order once we switch to stone skin, change nothing else, and see does she live longer or not? Or I mean, significantly longer. Oh man, that was raining on her. Many angry, angry and blue blows on her, but. If it looks like we're going to win, I want to end. That looks like we might have won, so. Anyone remember when Lost Realm first came out and you could, uh, you had to pay stamina to fight these battles. So you couldn't just keep switching your team out until you got a winning combo. All right, Serena, what do you got? Hanging in there so far. Man, Sasquatch is crazy. Oh, she's going down. Let's see. First to die. Yep. All right. So one. She did fast death. Two. First to die. Decent is what we'll say. We'll do it again. Probably like three times each here. You know, because there is some RNG who gets the first proc and whatnot. See her down here in the bottom. Oh, Dove don't like her for sure. She picks on her. 438,000 she got hit for. Oh, she's dead. See? So I'm going to put that 438k there. All right. Swing around to this one here. Gosh, I hope I have enough stamina to get through here. Yeah, I guess. Um, Where's she at? Here she is. Not sure what the red X is on that one. Maybe that is that Anubis. Oh, she's going down like a sack of potatoes. Sack of potatoes. Oh my. And she's out. Remind, <laughs> remind me. I'll show you uh, her artifacts when I get out of here. All right, this one looks a little better. Oh no! And then they just make it rain. Look how quickly she dies compared to everyone else dead. I'm not seeing any outstanding number. Quit doing that. Um, outstanding high number. Let's see if we can pick off what she's getting wrecked for. I wish that IGG come out with like a combat log, you know, that you could look at. Uh, and first dead. So what is this one? Three, we'll see. We'll say first dead. Um, 
die relatively fast. So, not good. Alright, we're on to number four here. Ooh, it's got that skin. I should have bought the skin the other day, but I didn't. And she's almost already dead. Oh, I can't see. Yeah, she's dead. Right? Yeah, I don't see those oct purple octopus legs. And mind you, I'm not saying when we switch to stone skin, we come back in here. Oh boy, she's dead. Right? She's dead already. I can't tell who's to the right of Walla. I'm pretty sure she's dead though. Oop, we might have won that one. Um, but I'm not saying these ones that we are legitimately losing that we're just going to win. My point is, can she live longer? Look, she's wasted. Dead again. So number four died fast. All right. Let's try this one. Hmm. She's, of course, dead first. And we got rolled on. I'm calling this number five. Let's see how it goes this time. Come on, big guy. I love Sasquatch. Wait, she's dead already. I'm not even paying attention. She's dead already. Hmm. Again, this is 8 8 Bulwark. And wait until you see her traits. She's. Look, you see no dodging right now. Dice fast. Alright, this one we don't need to watch again. Dice fast. Luckily, I mean, my team is hanging in there, and Dove doesn't have a pet on, so, like, if she had a pet, especially a healing pet, and Serena had a healing pet, we'd be in some pretty solid shape. Okay. So I think that's all I need to see. I'm going to pause the video, grab something to drink, come back. What time is it? Oh, okay. I thought it was reset. I'm like, wait, what? Um, come back and switch to the stone skin. And see what's up. See how it goes. We'll compare numbers. Be right back. I'm stuttering because I don't know where the pause is. <laughs> Maybe there isn't a pause. I don't use OBS that much. Well, we'll get right into it. There's only a stop recording. So, okay. Anywho, let's just do it. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, the pain. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, fame. Lucky if you give these guys a bunch of money, they give you these runes that you just level right up. All right, exact same thing going on, but 100% different talent. Reduces all damage taken. It doesn't say all, but I, I know it to be all. Um, by 60%. So let's see if that makes a difference. Start again. With some raids here. <laughs> we might end up getting, since we were just testing and dying out, some of the same bases. Hmm, you think these two is, are they by themselves? No. It's 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Well, let's just see what happens here. Oh, <laughs> Get in there, Dove, just nuke and stuff. Look at this. But look, she just taking the Trixie proc, no big deal. Good night. Sleep time. Her health hasn't. I hit end because I don't know if you heard that or, or not, but I have these headphones on, so I don't really hear it. But Alexa said something. I can't say it very loud because it'll trigger her. What the heck did she say? Hmm. She's crazy. So that was pretty good. Might have just been circumstance, but holy smokes, did she not take any damage. All right, here, this is a good one. Come on, waste them. 
hit the stun tires because they really make it hard to do the testing and still look like her health isn't high because she's being stunned and she can't heal but as far as taking those big hits she's she just isn't not those one two shot hits these stun towers though like you said the rng from the stun makes it hard to really oh here's our friend i think we did this one right uh makes it hard to really repeat all right let's see how it goes And remember, it's not about her damage right here. It's about her keeping Dove Keeper buffed up because Dove Keeper just is a nuke. So as long as she's alive, she can keep that buff on Dove Keeper. I hit and just because, but that was still quite a significantly longer time to live. Uh, let's not mess with this one. Hmm. I hate you stunt towers. I think she might get rocked before she can really try much here, but <laughs> Jesus, Dove Keeper. This guy's double evolved. I'm just getting wrecked. And then the stun tires. Oh, that Skelly, or uh, well, why don't even use it? Skull Knight just got rocked. You guys see that? One shot, like it didn't even show what the damage was. He just went from full health to zero. <clears throat> but notice the, I mean, what the first three tries it raids, we were getting rocked. Serena died how many of the first time? You can watch the video back. Seems to me she died several times. And this time she hasn't died yet. And certainly noticeably living a lot longer. Mm, I don't know about this one, but let's go to World. Ooh. This one's deep. Stuns and heavy hitting. Eat my face. Hmm. I really like to pull like one person out again. Think we can get this dove keeper alone? Nope. Oof. Those archer towers. Oof. Ooh, this should be fun. Ah, oh, accidentally dropped him. Oh well. Get that bug. <laughs> Look, these guys just getting rocked. Because they're not even Oh. Santa's double evolved. I don't know if the other guys were or not. But just once again another raid where not concerned for Serena's life. And I don't want to, uh, ooh, Serena sounds loud to me, sorry. I don't want to keep, you know, beating a dead horse here or anything. But I do want to do enough dungeons that you might agree that you can see a significant difference in the number of dungeons that we did versus the number of dungeons Serena died in. And look at these guys just dying. These are double evolved heroes just getting rocked. Why are they getting rocked? Because of Dove Keeper's buff. And why do we have, or I mean, Serena's buff. And we have Serena's buff because she's alive. One more. And we'll go, I think, to a more noticeable test. Ooh, this should be fun. Let's tank this guy. I think when we tanked this guy before, we didn't, we ended up leaving. And it didn't go all that great. So let's see what happens this time. Mmm, Serena got a decent hit in. Certainly nowhere. Oh, it's a dove keeper whacking it too. Come on, guys, keep it up. Come on, ladies. So again, dove keeper died and, and Serena didn't. So I feel comfortable to move on and say, without a doubt, at least in those tests for raids, the stone scan makes a significant, if not a large, large difference in survivability. So let's go up here to number one. Start where we left. The notes say dies fast. Does she die fast still? That is the question, folks. I didn't show your trades. She's getting nuked. Oh, well, she's staying alive. Are we going to beat him? She's definitely not dying fast. Sadly did die, but I wouldn't say that's dying fast at all. 
by the way, I have every intention of putting my artifacts and pets on and come back and whooping all these guys for making me look bad on here. Look at her, she's not dying at all this time. In fact, it looks like Wall is getting it. That's kind of a compounding advantage to the stone skin because if Dove Keeper attacks the hero with the lowest HP, the stone skin keeping her from taking the bigger hits also keeps her from being one of the heroes with the lowest HP. And we just did that twice. The other time we did it, what, four times, three times, five times? And the notes were dies fast. And look what just happened. Pretty super happy about that, to be honest. Because in front of, you know, you 10 people that are going to watch this video, you, I don't look like a guy that doesn't know completely what he's talking, not what he's talking, what he's not talking about, I don't know. Because I've been screaming, stone skin's the best. A lot of people say flame guard, maybe, or not a lot of people, some people have said flame guard, maybe at some point. I mean, look at this, she's totally alive. Um, first to die, uh, she got hit for 438k of the notes from this one, the last one. This one, she's not going anywhere health-wise. Definitely not getting hit for 438k. Come on, guys, we got this. Nice. Wow. One shot. And last time we got our butt kicked. This is pretty, pretty darn impressive. And last time she had 8 8 Bulwark, meaning she was doing more damage. But again, can't do that damage if you're dead. Can we press this? No. So. That's two for two. Pretty, uh, pretty excited that this worked out the way that it did. I mean, even if the other three, we still have the exact same results, then I would still say it's made a huge difference because we just walked through two out of five that we got stomped on after doing four or five times a piece. So next one. Number three here. Looks like the notes is first to die. And died relatively fast. So not super fast, but early in the game. Let's see how it goes. I haven't looked at the names. It'd be funny if it's anybody that I know and that I know watches this. All right. Serena's taking a beating right now. Get her up. Heal, girl. Heal, heal, heal. Oh, 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 snap. Get up, girl. Get up. Imagine if she had a pet and Duff had a pet right now. It's two heroes without pets. Come on. Come on, come on. This would be so sweet. Oh, no, no. This isn't good. But look how she's definitely not the first to die. And look how much she's living. And the longer she lives, the more she's healing and buffing. Pretty impressive. Oh, Wally, you let me down, Walla. You let me down. Dovekeeper didn't. And those of you that gave me a hard time about taking my bulwark off of Dovekeeper, which, by the way, means two of the last heroes I put 8-8 eight, eight bulwark on and regretted it. Um but and switch to uh war god I'm trying to think or that's what i did right yeah it was totally worth it look she it's not like she dies quickly so this one was first to die dies decently fast so if we can't beat it no big deal but we've learned that she's living a heck of a lot longer than she did the first time man that wall is not taking any damage Really, that one other pet or two other pets would really, I think, make a big difference. Oh, get that Wallace. Just take him out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Get him, get him, get him. Miss, 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 miss. Miss, miss, miss. One more, one more, one more. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, man. That's a bummer. He was so low so many times. I did these like four times the first time. So enough to keep it on the level, we'll do this again. Man, who is that? Is that my Anubis, I guess? Alright, well, he's not going to sell them, so let's move on. That's a War God Anubis, by the way. 
one of my next projects is is to get my stone skin Anubis Max because, and I mean I could go do it right now, but I uh, come on, we gotta take out this wall. I don't understand why we're not killing anything. Um, it's, it's just some like Guild Wars sniping. If you really want them just to be there to kill the troops and truck everything, that stone skin's nice. Oof, damn, we got rolled this one. All right, we'll move on from this one, but it's definitely the third success in a row of her living considerably longer. I mean, if not winning. So this one dies fast. Yeah, these last two we got owned. So let's see what happens now. Boy, they sure went straight for her, though, Serena. But look, she's up. She's full even. What is that purple? Is that her heel? What was that, like, cloud around her? That? What is that? Is that her? Never noticed that purple cloud. How did I have never noticed? Is it Bublo? Oh, uh, look at that. Dies fast. Number four was dies fast. We did it four times. We got owned. The only thing that changed is that she has stone skin now instead of 8-8 eight, eight bulwark. And, and look, we just walked right through it. Other than this annoying Anubis that's doing nobody any good. That's a huge statement. Prove me wrong. Good luck. Bulwark, you're out of here. Which takes War God completely out of the question. Ooh, get that heal prod, girl. Um, because obviously it's not even as defensive. Ooh, she's going down. As defensive as uh, Bulwark and Bulwark doesn't work. All right, this one's another dies fast. We got owned in this one. She is dead. I wouldn't say she died fast, but she is dead. So I don't know if we're going to pull this one off, but... Oh, looks like we got some sweet procs. So we just went from dies fast to win again. Was that first shot? I forgot. If not, it's second shot. Well, it might not be a win. We'll see. You never know how these things go. Dovekeeper's still alive, so... Come on, take him out. I just want to say another one shot. I'm pretty sure it's one shot, but it might be two shots. It doesn't matter. Either way, I'm, I'm, I, this is just absolute proof that I'm absolutely right that the survivability for her from Bulwark to Stone Skin is totally worth it. It's absolutely, absolutely huge. And yes, I've said absolutely a lot. Ah, yeah. that makes me happy. Mega me very happy. Oh man, cool, cool. This is about, I've been thinking how do I do this video and it took me like five days to lose all these uh towers okay I don't do that right now I want to finish the video but what I did want to do is go in here change I gotta go win that other one just to so you guys can see either the struggle or the win Let's see how we do so what do we got uh any Angie's already there. Rudolph could be on Dove. Because she's a tank. And Bublo's already there. I think if we live... Hmm, I don't know if we live or need damage in that one more. But let's go ahead and give her a Yule Effect just in case. We should be able to live. And hopefully we'll get good procs from Dove Keeper. And artifacts. Oh, she was living fine. What do you guys think? Reduced damage taken, maybe? Probably life, probably not. But maybe that little extra damage will help. Let's just see how this goes first. All right, go back in here and smack this guy around. Smack him around. I should have looked. Who owned? Um, oh. There he is. There he is. Who is it? You're going down SVZ3000. Zero, zero, zero. Cool name. Hmm. What do we got? 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 Serena going down. Serena going down. Serena needs miles. Serena Serena need the help. Heal the Sasquatch. Heal the Sasquatch. Gonna need you heal. What? Mmm, all these healing beds. They let me down. So it looks like Serena should probably go ahead and go in victors, but 
Who is that? Is that my Anubis or his in that middle with low health? Eh, not cool. All right. Make sure she's got. Yeah, let's put her in Victor's, I guess. Victor's. She's not there for damage anyway. Could put her in Goblet of Life. Let's do that. Let's just keep her alive, all right? She's alive. She's healing. And we need healers in our life. You know, we need healers. But I need mm -mm. All right. Winner. Right here. Come on, guys. Don't make me switch the team around. I should check, though. Like, some of these other guys that I wasn't doing. Oh, man. Serena. Uh... Huh, come on guys, come on, get a pick. Dove, where are you at? Hmm, well, do what I normally do. First thing I do is switch sides. Sometimes that is all I need to do. The right hero takes the beating. I don't know, something just ends up changing. Need to... Focus this stupid Wallace, keeping them all alive, procking that AOE. Whatever this dude's deal is, he's definitely doing a good job at making this one difficult. Oh no, don't put the Serena buff on yourself, you baddie. <laughs> proc, Walla, proc. Hmm. Ooh. You know what? I will come back and do this one. It still doesn't change anything that it was such a huge difference going to the stone skin. I'm extremely happy that I did it. I'm glad that I have it on her. I have to do some tweaking here to win this one. But that's fine. But I just realized the video is 37 minutes long. So you guys probably need to get to bed or something. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope that you found it as definitive as I do. Um, I'm sure that in some scenarios like Archdemon, a Bulwark, or a War God would be better on her um, just for that little more damage, but or a lot more, I guess, if it's War God. Uh, but all in all, I'm happy with what I got, what I use her for, Lost Realm, Lost Battlefield, Guild Wars, Guild Wars defense, I don't know, sniping. So, glad I did it. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying your Serena. Please subscribe, and have a good day.